beat already. Just made the run out here to our bull shark barge. Gonna go ahead and get these live wells going this morning. Sleeves already wet. I got one. Wow. Just one. The first one this morning though. Got some bait. As Blues Blue says, bait is the key to fishing. Well, yeah, you need bait. Just made it out to our first spot of the morning, about 90 foot of water. We we're gonna try and do some kite fishing because we thought there's enough wind. Fortunately right now, Josh, is there any wind? Not too much. Not too much wind right now, guys. Not enough. Not enough wind, so not we're gonna go ahead and do some bump kite. trolling. And hopefully later we can fly the kite. We still got plenty of baits. We lost a couple already, but that tends to happen anyway with bait. It always seems to go that way. You always lose a couple. So we're gonna bump troll these guys around a little bit. Maybe we can get a sail first thing in the morning. That's the hopes, that's the dreams. Wasn't running for Hooked up first thing this morning. Nice sail. That's about a 60 pounder, right? Oh, he's he's there, look at him go. Nice. I'd say about 60 pounds. 65? I don't think I think, yeah, he's small, but he's long. I'm trying to envision half of me, all right? And is he about as tall? He's about as long as I am tall. Oh, yeah, he's about as tall as you are. <laughs> and he's probably just as skinny, just as skinny. He's a little skinny. Slip. A little skinnier? Yeah. Well, I'm a buck 30, buck 40. Buck 40. Hello. You can just barely see him right there. Oh, beautiful fish. He's small. Yeah, beautiful fish though, Harold. Ready for a signal? Yep. First thing in the morning. Oh, there you go. Ready? Nice shot. We're going by some really nice little mats. That's the word. Mats of seaweed here. There's nothing. I'm catching nothing on them. So you got a really nice one right there, a couple nice ones up over there, a whole bunch of nice ones back there, and nothing. He's right on you guys. I thought I saw a sail pop up before. There he is. There he is. Alright. Here's to not losing it all again. Oh, we're already. Well, this, actually, I take that back. This is where we were last time, so we're good. All right. All right. Getting the kite set up. We're almost done. We had a sail come up as we were trolling and started hitting the bait. So we couldn't connect with them, of course. We decided we finally got enough wind. We're gonna switch it up and try some kite fishing. All right. So on fish. Uh, unofficially. Unfortunately, the fishing has turned slow today. Well, there's plenty of wind, as you can tell, and we are attempting to fly two kites. I think it's going to work. We just need to get the second one up. Josh is letting down to the bottom, I believe. We're marking fish 70 foot. Josh, Josh. Harold's got to figure out where to put his kite right. We're going to do that real quick. That's two of them, bro. Are you going under? You saw that? Yeah. yeah. Wait, go under. Let him go, I got him, 
fish ever. Woo! Woohoo! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I got you, I got you. Hand it to me. Another sail. There you go, Josh. Well, so you know, we're just sitting out here. I had a sandwich. You know. Oh, oh you better reel, 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 reel. Take a waves. Oh, look at the colors on him. Wow. Just be ready with that rod if he has to let go, Josh. Oh, be ready, be ready, be ready. Josh's first sailfish. Woo! I'll be able to get pictures off of this. Nice, beautiful fish. That's a sick pick. That's a sick pick. You just got to be the sail was flared up. Woo! -hoo! Woo! Josh. Hell yeah. Three sail day today so far. We still got two baits out now. Two, one, one, two. <laughs> got two baits out. Woo! Finally. Biggest fish. Oh. You good with it if I leave it just like this, Harold? Yeah. Take a big mutton. Take a big mutton right now, right, Josh? Yeah. That's what it is. It's a mutton. That's a keeper. Oh, yeah. Got a keeper mutton in the boat. Look at that, Harold. Oh, keeper mutton. There you go. Good stuff, Josh. Bro, he skied on them. Uh, bro, you saw him? No, I missed him. Bro, he's a nice one. Yeah? Dude, he skied. Fish the gap. Right there. You see him sky? Bro, I was like, oh my god! And then I just, like, I got a 50-50 chance on which rod it is. Got it, got it, got it. Guilty, guilty. Oh. Well, at least we got that on camera. That's pretty neat. I knew he didn't have it because the, the hook was too far up. So as you can tell, it is rough. But we're managing to fly two kites out of the boat today. It's rough. It's bumpy. It is. I think the troll motor's dying. But it is just rough, gnarly. Land is just barely over the horizon there. It is gonna be a bumpy, bumpy, bumpy ride in. That's a nice wave right there. Oh, we're gonna stuff. Here, catch for the day. Oh yes, big old king and a nice mutton. Nice day, big old kingfish. Nice. 
nice and wet. Yeah. What's up with the sail thing? What's Damn. Today? Thursday. Huh? Oh, I know what you're thinking. He's thinking Chip Filet, the Lord's Chicken. We gotta do it. That's gonna wrap up today's video. If y'all like that video, hit the like and the subscribe button. Me, I think Harold, maybe Josh. We'll see y'all next time. Hit.